Hey guys, it's Jeff and Brian from Blaze Bite. We're at the Ice House Tavern and Grill on Brook Park Road. Unfortunately, it was a bit windy and we couldn't use the audio from the original clip. Uh, we want to give a big shout out to Nick Edelberg for recommending this place. He told me I needed to stop wasting my time at all of the other bars I've been to. And if I wanted the best wings in Cleveland, I have to check out the Ice House. Let's go inside and check it out. Brian and I are drinking not our usual beers, but unsweetened tea and Diet Coke. It's lunchtime. To, to cleanse our palate. I think it'd be frowned upon if I went back to work with alcohol on me. <laughs> yeah, I kind of have a be responsible at work, so. If you come here between four and I think 10, they have wings, you can get a dozen wings. It's a little over seven bucks. Uh, ends up being around 60 cents a wing, so it's a good deal. So Brian, one of the things that I'm, <laughs> One of the things that we saw on the menu that was awesome was they said that if you have to wait 20 minutes before the wings are ready. So yeah. they're going to come out extra crispy is what I've heard. It's really good for dinner, not so good for a tight lunch schedule. <laughs> but hey, we're going to try to make it work. So we got our three flavors, right? Which ones are which? Do you remember? Oh, I have no clue. I'm going to guess this is the wet Cajun. Yep. Because it's got like a Cajun, but it's wet. And this is the spicy garlic parmesan right here. And then um, the last one left over, honey honey barbecue. Honey barbecue, Nick's yeah. favorite. Don't so we forget should probably this. start there because yep. that's the mildest and then work our way up literally probably this way. All right, perfect. Let's so, go first. Check it out. Right away you can tell it's, there's a reason why they put a time limit on these. These look extra crispy, so. Yeah, you can tell these are sauced really well. Yeah. They're yeah. they're big. I mean, good size, too. I would say, um, you know, you got some small, some larger ones. Yeah, I don't see too many small ones, actually. Yeah, I would say the majority of them are large wings, for sure. That's, yeah. All right, Impressed cheers. so far. Cheers. It's very, very sweet. The barbecue is really good, actually. I'm impressed. I like it a lot. I think it's good. The only thing I would say is... Um, so I'm more of a, I like the edges crispy, not slimy, but I would say for my liking, you like yours extra crispy. It's a little bit too crispy for me. Just a little bit. Not for me. I I love them crispy, like you had mentioned. Um, for a sweet sauce, man, oh, is that amazing. Nick, I do like it a lot. Good job on that. Um, Definitely. What are you, what are you going to give it? Um, you know what? It's, it doesn't have a lot of kick to it. But I still think it's a great barbecue. I would order that for sure. So I usually order some spicy and some mild. This would be my go-to mild for sure here. <clears throat> um, I'm going to give it a 7.7. 7. It's a good score. Yeah. Um, for me, this is awesome for a sweet wing. Out of all the wings we've tried so far, this has been the best sweet sauce, I think. And I'm going to... Usually I like a little more kick as well. But overall, I'm going to give this one a 7.7. Seven, seven. Seven, seven, okay. Well, this one is perfectly cooked because I think it's a little bigger. So the first one I grabbed was maybe a little bit small. I felt like it might have been a little bit too crispy. This one's perfect. So I'm really impressed with this. It's got a, a little bit of a spice. I don't think it's overwhelming by any means. And you can really taste the garlic like... I'm gonna feel bad going back to my coworkers. They're just gonna smell garlic <laughs> in my office. No, yeah. I Sorry, guys. <laughs> I love the garlic. Garlic's one of my favorite. It's usually, some people think it's overpowering, but I love a lot of garlic on my wings. And I think it, it does have a little kick, um, but I, I, I'm impressed. So far, I'm impressed with the size of the wings. I think they're cooked awesome. Um, with this one, I'm gonna give it a, I'm gonna give this one an eight, Eight two. I think I'm right on the same page with you. Um, I, I'm gonna say this is one of the better. We've had a couple different garlics and garlic spicy garlics. It needs a little bit more spice, so I think I'm gonna give it for that. I'm gonna give it an eight one because it's not really that spicy. So cheers. 
This is the spicy, or no, this is wet Cajun. Smells good. This I think is, is again, I can't get over how well they're cooked. Um, the 20 minutes is well worth it if you like a crispy wing. When you come during happy hour, you just drink a few more before you eat wings. No big deal. But yeah, I would say this sauce is kind of weird though. I don't really taste, it's wet. I can taste a little bit of the Cajun, but it doesn't taste spicy at all. Man, I thought this was going to be a, a hotter sauce. Right, it's Cajun makes you think hot. But I would say, I, I would say I don't normally drink, eat a dry rub wing. So I, if I'm going to eat Cajun, it, I prefer it to be wet. Yeah, so what's your rating on this one? Um, you know what? I'm going to give it a... It's, you know, I'm going to give it a 6.6. .6. Just because, not that it's not cooked bad, it's just the sauce was... I, I, would, I don't know if I'd order this sauce again. I'm with you on that. Um, overall, it, it, it's a decent sauce. If you like Cajun, yeah. you would probably really enjoy this one. Uh, I'm going to go with a 6.5, a, a 6.5 okay. overall. I think um, that does it for this uh, Blaze Bite wing review. We're still on the hunt for the uh, the best wings in Northeast Ohio. Uh, I definitely put Ice House as a contender. And uh, make sure you like us on Facebook and follow us. On Instagram, subscribe to our YouTube channel. All right, thanks guys. Cheers to Blaze Bite. Cheers.